God. <laughs> I look up from the camera, I see it coming straight at me, like, ah! Hello and welcome to Incoming RC. My name is Lucas Weekly, and today we're going to be talking about this. This is a maker trainer, but it's a little bit more special, and um, I'll, I'll explain. So let's back up a little bit first. For those of you who aren't familiar, the Maker Trainer comes from the series that I produced for Make Magazine called Maker Hanger. And I got a lot of questions from people inside the US who were asking, uh, is there anywhere that I can buy these parts for the plane that come from the US so I don't have to wait for like a month for all these parts to come in from Hobby King? Plus at the time, there were so many people wanting to build the Maker Trainer that all the parts for it from Hobby King were back ordered. Uh, but anyway, I didn't really have an answer for them because I didn't have funding for Make to go try out another set of parts. And I also didn't really know of a dealer that had good parts. I've always heard bad things about parts that came from the US and I didn't want to go into any of the really bigger companies. So a couple months after Maker Hanger ended, I needed some parts for a plane that I was building. And I happened to go to one of the newer RC shops in um, my city. and. Uh, it's called Heads Up RC, and I talked to them and I got some parts for my plane and they turned out really well. I really liked the parts that they gave me, or I purchased from them. So I came back, told them about the series, told them about the Maker Trainer, and then told them about my problem where there was no one in the US who could supply the parts for it. And they're like, okay. So they put together a parts list and they gave me all the parts for the Maker Trainer and they wanted me to test them out to put the parts list on the uh, Maker Hanger series. So all the parts on this Maker Trainer, except for the radio system because they don't carry that, come from Heads Up RC. So that's the motor, the propeller, the ESC on the inside, the batteries, uh, the servos, all the stuff except for the materials like the foam come from Heads Up RC, which is really cool. And they're about the same price too as the ones coming from uh, Poppy King. I bet you are all wondering how this performs. And uh, so let's go fly it right now. That's pretty fast. That's why I like doing it. I also like doing it so that the wings come underneath my feet and then I have to jump rope it. <coughs> <laughs> do you want to do that? <laughs> no. So like I said before, when I got parts from them, I was really impressed by them, and these did not disappoint either. They're way more powerful than the ones that I got from Hobby King. It gets about the same flight time, about 20 minutes, but you're never going to fly for that long anyway. The servos are exactly the same ones from Hobby King. They carry the exact same Tower Pro blue servos. Uh, the ESC is a little bit more powerful because the motor spins a little bit more faster with a smaller propeller. Still gets the same battery life, so it's fine. And uh, the batteries that they have are all 50C. There's nothing less than that, and which is great because they're the same price as the Hobby King ones, but they're really, really durable and everything, and they have really good response times. And I've drained them down to like nine volts. And normally, if you don't know, that'll take a battery and puff it up really big. But these don't do anything. You just put it back on the charger and it's fine. So the batteries are really great. I really like their batteries. Besides the Maker Trainer, I purchased the parts for an FPV quadcopter using all their parts. And this one outperforms the NTM uh, prop drive 1200 kV motor uh, quadcopter. That's the motor that everyone's using online. It outperforms this one by a lot. And this one flies for about 15 minutes on a 3000 milliamp 3 cell. The other one is only like five minutes. And this one out 
climbs it, it performs it, it goes faster, and uh, I really like these parts. It uses uh, larger propellers. Um, uh, these are uh, 10 inch props, the other one's eight inch props, but this one flies great and uh, way better than the other one that I have. So I just wanted to give a shout out to Heads Up RC. They're an awesome company. They ship nationwide, so you can order their parts from anywhere in the country. They have great electronics. I'll have a parts list up for this in the description uh, soon. And uh, more on that quadcopter later as well, but you'll be seeing a lot of their parts and a lot of my builds coming up. And maybe some, even some conversions from other kit planes that use their parts. So uh, stay tuned for that, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.